continuing to track the growing flood concerns throughout the state. With record snow pelt melting in the Sierra, there's a rush to capture all that extra water coming down the hill. In the cycle from extreme dry to wet, the state is putting flood water to work, expediting programs to make use of all the extra water. With many reservoirs and lakes starting to fill, the Department of Water Resources is turning to below ground storage by diverting water to more beneficial areas, especially in the Central Valley. The DWR was really seeking projects that would help reduce the amount of flood water that was ending up coming down the Kings River and filling this new Tulare Lake. And so they were looking for projects where we could offload some of that flow. A flow that could reach historic levels given the record-setting snow in the Southern Sierra. As the water runs downstream, the Fresno Irrigation District is able to take the excess and pump it into storage areas just west of the city. Uh, the plan is to not store it there and later use it as surface water, but let it percolate into the ground, recharge the aquifer, and it, we have surrounding agricultural, urban, and rural residential wells that are pumping water out of this groundwater aquifer. Since that aquifer is about 100 feet below the surface, it will take several months for the water to actually reach it, likely usable by the winter. So the state is hoping to capture upwards of 55,000 acre feet of spring runoff, alleviating those flood impacts to communities and bolstering the amount of water stored underground. A double win, right?